Hi YouTube, this is a bit of concept art that I did for a kind of weird uh, insect alien creature. Um, I quite often do these before my sculpts. Okay, so this was the first stage of the sculpt, which was just to build a wire armature. Um, this is quite easy to do with aluminium wire, you just um, twist the wire around itself. Um, you could use like thin pliers and it makes it really easy. For the next stage I just bulked out the main shape with just aluminium foil and um, this is really easy to kind of manipulate into the shape that you want and it saves you a lot of money on um, Sculpey or other materials. Okay then I use a product called Super Sculpey um, which comes in a block that looks a bit like the size of a brick um, and it's about £20 I suppose and the Super Sculpey that I get is this kind of flesh colour you can buy other colours as well and then you just make kind of thin layers of this and you just pad it on around all the aluminium foil um, once you're done this will end up being baked in the oven to make it go hard okay this is with all of the Super Sculpey on to create the main form overall I've just started to add more detail into this and this is exactly the same stage but just photograph from a different angle Okay, you can see I've coated the base also with Super Sculpey, only a thin layer, um, but I've also added loads more detail into this. You can see like the teeth at the front um, and all the kind of um, detail of the spine and on the back and uh, further detail into the claws and all the joints and that kind of thing. And this is photographed at a different angle so you can see some of the extra textures and things that I've added. Then I painted the whole thing black. I quite often do this with all of my sculpts, either paint them black or paint them really dark. Um, this just then allows you to kind of dry brush various colours over the top uh, and it keeps the black in all the sort of deepest parts and it gives a much more realistic effect and makes them look um, a lot more solid in the end. Okay, this is how he ended up. So you can see after the black, I then dry brushed some very dark blue on um, and then I dry brushed some light blue just into the kind of highlight areas uh, and just got paler and paler at each stage basically. Um, I also added textures onto the base, things like um, twigs and stones just stuck on with glue and then I just painted all that as well. Again, really dark purple colour to start with and then just dry brushed a lighter purple on top of that. The uh, eyes were just done with glass cabochons. Um, okay, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, check out my other videos because I've got lots of different sculpts that I've done. Um, and I've done loads of uh, kind of 80s movie creatures uh, and yeah, lots of kind of monsters and things like that. They're what I enjoy the most really. Um, and there'll be loads in there that you recognise probably. Things like gremlins and that kind of thing. Critters. Um, so yeah, check those out and hit subscribe to see anything I do in the future.